we are manifesting that we are going to be living in a better place than where we are right now um this time next year i turn the cake yeah all about cake yeah yeah can't relate uh, uh, all about cake yeah yeah Welcome back to Ray's image. I am Ray Soul. Welcome back to our channel. This clearly isn't the natural setting or the usual setting. But today I am doing a get ready with me. Just kind of, you know, one on however many people is watching type of talk, one on one talk. A little mini vlog today. So we're just going to do something different. I don't have too much planned as far as speaking I, there are things that i want to talk about but i don't have it like written down or anything so it may be a little bit everywhere i'm gonna go ahead and get ready i washed my face last night y'all and i woke up with this this just gonna go ahead and get ready if you are new to the channel make sure you subscribe and turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss anything So because I woke up with this bump on my face, I'm probably gonna wash my face again. I don't wanna touch it too much, but I'm probably gonna wash my face again because I just like having a clean base. I don't know where that came from. Maybe my pillowcase, maybe it's time to change my sheets again. I don't know, maybe oils, I don't know. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wash my face, do my face routine and then um, get dressed. I'm gonna let this dry on my skin. It's actually a little bit later in the day because I actually woke up on time, but then when I was checking my social media, y'all, yeah, somebody really killed takeoff. It's so sad. Like I I'm I'm just like I don't even know what to say. It's not really my place to say much. But all we can say now is that it's just, you know, it shouldn't have happened, not over a dice game. And yeah, no gun should have been pulled out and he should not have lost his life. That should not have happened. And it's just so eerie when you go on when like uh influencer or artist loses their life and then you go on their story like their instagram story and they still have like something that they post from moments before or hours before and it just shows you that life is just way too short you don't know what's gonna happen i'm just no i'm not gonna say anything else about it it's just really sad like rest in peace to him um condolences to his family we all know that the Migos, their family. So let's keep them in our prayers. I know the industry be doing some weird stuff, covering up, you know, certain, we all know the industry covers up certain deaths to make it look like something else, but it was really a sacrifice or planned. But I really don't think this was supposed to happen. I really don't. Definitely feel like this was an accident. Anyways, condolences and keep praying for the family because it's so hard. We all know what it feels like to lose somebody close to us or a loved one. So we're gonna pray for them. And I'm just gonna keep this on my face, um, maybe for a few more minutes. It's already tight. Like I really like this soap. It's the Clarifying Cleansing Soap by Good Molecules, by the way. If y'all go to my Instagram, y'all will see my skincare routine. And I had Mahalia Organics Charcoal and Turmeric Bar for my face, but I ran out. And then when I needed to restock, she didn't have him. 
so i just went ahead and then all the other all the other products that i use are from good molecules so i just went ahead and bought like a clarifying cleanser bar from good molecules and it actually does it i really really like it i'm not gonna say i like good molecules clarifying bar versus mahali organics but they're both really 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 good products natural all that i know y'all like girl like y'all barely post and you just gonna come on here and act like you've been talking to us for the longest tell us what's tea tell us what's up really not much right now sorry not much is going on all right child beta now obedience is key images at work i'm home that's pretty much it but might i be honest that i have been not as active on instagram a good reason why i just feel like lately i've just needed a detox from posting and just being on there so often i just kind of cut back for my own mental space if you're anything like me right now you are being separated and forced into silence not forced in a bad way but like being still with yourself and not around chaos forced into silence so that anything that god is telling you right now it couldn't be clear for you to hear i know you're used to controlling i know you're you want to take control you want to have control but he is waiting for you to relinquish with faith relinquish control to God with faith and just listen so that he can bless the efforts that you've been putting forth if anybody else relates go in the comment section right now and type the blue butterfly let me wash this off my face we're not gonna do any makeup today just because I guess my skin is a little more clogged than usual. I got a couple spots that look like they about to, you know, I'm not gonna speak that. My skin is getting clear. My skin is getting clear. My skin is evening out, getting clear, and it is cleansed. It is being cleansed. But anyways, it's all right. It's gonna go away. Y'all, me and Image are coming up on three years of marriage. Wow. Oh my goodness. Have y'all seen From Scratch? Girl. Girl, my homegirl put me on. I seen some people talking about it on Facebook and I was like, mm, I'll get around to it. But then when she was like, no, watch it. I was like, bet. And y'all, if y'all have not seen From Scratch yet on Hulu, I mean, not on Hulu, on Netflix. Here you go. I just gave you something to watch. Now, if you have Hulu and you haven't seen This Is Us, you need to watch that too. I think this is how we're gonna do it today. I got my little three little locks in the back hanging out. I'm okay with that. I'm gonna get my tea tree oil. Well, not mine, but image. It's tea tree oil. And I'm gonna put it on my edges. I think this is the look for today. What am I gonna wear? I'm trying to think. Look at outside. Y'all see the leaves? It's so pretty. The red leaves are my favorite. That's nice. Okay. Give me a second, cause I'm really trying to think like what am I gonna wear?
Do I want to look cute and sophisticated? Or do I want to look cute and bummy? Which one shall it be? Which one will it be? Let it be. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop this and come back because I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have a mental breakdown if I don't figure out what I am going to wear today and I need to focus. So back in a second. Okay, this is what we're doing. We got the all black on with the jean jacket and my scarf because I do believe it's cold outside. I'm cutting some lights on. It is dark in here. Ooh, work with me. Put some earrings on, but I don't feel like going through my earrings. Oh, I paired my blue bag since I have on jeans. I actually need to throw some of this stuff in here away. I got a fork in here. Not a fork, two forks. Why do I have two forks in my purse? I got double the power. I got a Listerine cool strip and I got gum, which I'm actually gonna stop chewing gum because of my jaws. I'm getting my wisdom, my top two wisdom teeth pulled out in December, the second week of December. Pray for me. No, for real though, pray for me, cause I'm scared. They're not putting me to sleep. They're only um, giving me laughing gas. And I really wanted him to put me to sleep cause I don't want, I don't want to hear nothing. I don't want to feel nothing. And he was like, oh, it's not gonna hurt. I'm gonna, we're gonna make sure you're nice and numb and i'm like i need to be nice and sleep though there's a difference i'm actually really nervous but i got a month and some change so the nerves ain't kicked in all the way just yet but just pray for me decided to put earrings on I haven't even really been outside like that. I've been in the house lately. I got on a scarf and I am hot. Okay, yeah, this guy's to come off for now. Mm -mm. That is not it. Seat belts first, so we can be safe. Where am I going? Go to the FedEx office place, okay. I have no idea where that is. GPS, one second. We are manifesting that we are gonna be living in a better place than where we are right now, um, this time next year. Yeah, it's like two police officers posted up right there and we got the fire department in the pot. What's going on today? Jesus. All right, rolling windows up too loud y'all i really like to listen to my music in the car like, oh that's that's too cold i want air but i don't want polar express i don't like driving in silence unless i'm really deep into my thoughts yeah, so i'm going to the fedex office to ship or to send out this card to my homegirl best friend road in norcross I just think that's so cute. Like who names a road called Best Friend Road? It's literally called Best Friend Road. That is so cute to me. I want a Best Friend Road. Now I'm hot. Now I'm gonna need Polar Express AC because why am I so hot? It's November. Jesus. I forgot what I was saying. Okay, that's enough. Chill out on the air. Turn it down. But eventually I want to put my sis, my good sis, on a little vloggy vlog with me y'all so y'all can really capture how me and her interact with each other it's so ridiculous y'all will have to excuse y'all know i don't really curse but i don't really cuss like that but y'all will have to excuse her mouth if she does because she's probably going to i forgive her it's all right but that's my girl i love me some zaria shout out to you boo Okay, now that that is done, we're going to Target. 
I just kind of feel like I've been really quiet these days. I've just been really wanting to focus on me, you know, and focus on my marriage, focus on growth, just staying positive despite what, you know, my circumstances may be, despite how I'm feeling. You know, when God gives you that strength of doing it anyways, when you don't feel like doing certain things, when you're not in the mood to do certain things, when you don't when you don't have the energy to do certain things, it's like I really be feeling like God gives me his that 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 extra strength that I need, that power to help me do it anyways because it's good for me, because I need it, because it needs to get done, you know, that type of energy. So I'm grateful for that. The sky is so pretty today. Look at that. Look at that. It's been a minute since I've been to Target. At the same time, I'm just in here. Whatever speaks to me. <laughs> These are all messed up and I suddenly have the compulsion to fix them all. Where did this go? Oh, this goes here. And I can't because that's full. Okay, that's why they did that. Well, this is 60. Where does, see, 60, 60 goes, 60 is right here. See, why is this all the way up there? Okay, this is 160. That's the, I think I am 160. I need to stop because I think I'm this color. What y'all think? I think I'm this color. What do you think that one is my shade? This would be more like a highlight and then this would be more like a contour maybe? I don't know. Do people still do that? Who knows? But I really like this shade. I think this is my shade. But thinking about trying it out. That's 140, the middle one is 90, and then the last one is 190. There's really only like one candle that I actually like to smell that's like, what does it say? Mm. Ooh, cookie exchange. I'm gonna smell this. Very sweet. Passion fruit. That smells flowery, floral, and clean. I really need another, I need a hard case suitcase. I'm not gonna get one, but this just reminded me that I need, I need a hard case one. I can't wait to have like all hardwood floors. That way I can have like rugs and placemats everywhere. My literal favorite. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Y'all, look at that. Look at that. This is another reason why I like coming here. Because I like to see what all the spray deodorants they have. Because I know Walgreens doesn't always have all of the scents. Sorry, that's a habit. Look, I just can't help myself. When you've worked in retail, you have OCD and a tad bit of ADHD. You can't help it. But yeah, right now, this is the deodorant that I use. But for soap, we definitely use Dr. Bronner's. I've been looking at this for a minute now. I've seen this all over social media and online. I've been thinking about getting an image like the Manscaped kit because he shaves, but like I really want to get him, you know, like the, the, there you go, the lawnmower, <laughs> you know. The the, the, the the manscaping. I thought there were more products than this. I, I saw more products online, but I don't think they have it in this store. 
I've smelled this one. This one smells really good. I have, no, I had this one. I ran out. I'm using this one currently, the strawberry. And the watermelon with Shea Body Butter. I'm really getting out of here now because I have no business being in here any longer. Why is it this hot in November? Like, why is it hot inside of my car right now? Water's still cold though. Now I'm getting sleepy. This is what I get for getting old. Why do you just pull up in here like that? Oh, he in a rush rush. Y'all see him? Let me stop being in folks' business. And go home. No matter what, let the pedestrians go. Like, let people who are walking past go. It's never that serious to stop and wait for them to pass, you know, to walk across. I just wanna say that because I definitely almost got hit by a car several times because people didn't wanna wait or they weren't paying attention. Okay, I need GPS and I need music. So I'll see y'all when I'm back at home fixing something to eat because I'm starving. Oh, I lied. I came home and took a nap. I am old. Okay. Are you showing my cheeks? <laughs> I know I'm thick, but goodness, trying to show the whole world how thick I am. Yeah, I'm dressed. What are you doing? Say hey to Squad, what's up? Y'all, y'all keep the shirt. I keep the shirt. It says, "Valuable people attract people of value." I had to get it. It's a, it's a nice and positive shirt. I saw it at the mall. This guy was selling his merch. I had to get it. So I was sleep for what, two hours. You were sleep. Wow. We both were sleep. Gonna end the vlog here. Thank y'all for watching. Next time I do a vlog, I'll make sure that I actually have something to do. But I just wanted y'all to see a little bit more, like, you know, a little more action than what we typically been doing lately. So make sure you share this video with your mom. Your dad. Your sister. Your brother. Your cousin. Your aunt. Your uncle. Your niece. Your nephew. Your neighbor. Oh, no, your granddad. Your grandma. Your neighbor and... Your pet. And we'll see y'all in the next video.